What is going on guys? Welcome back to GTA Online and well as y'all know it is Thursday which means the time trials have been reset. For the vehicle time trial this week we have the Elysian Island 2 which I found this one to be pretty fun to do and luckily you could pretty much complete this one with any of these sports cars and or the supercars. I actually decided to pick up the Jester RR which I honestly have not really driven this car all that much. We all know this thing is a new Supra which I have a feeling the memes are going to start pouring in. But I have to admit this car is going to be a lot better than I thought. The stability and handling of it is actually really good. Plus it has pretty decent speed as well for it being a sports car, but when it comes to the route on this one, so for the beginning of this time trial, all you have to do is follow the waypoint like you normally would over here. Now if you guys really wanted to, you could probably continue and follow it over this bridge in this area into the city, but personally I found it a little bit easier to go onto the railroad tracks. Now there could be a train in this area, I personally have not seen that spawn over here when I have done this, but definitely keep an eye out for that. That would probably mess the run up depending on which side of the tracks you guys are going to be on. But after that, all you then have to do is take a left onto this road here by the Arena Workshop. Now, one thing I do recommend, by the way, guys, is watching out for the poles in this area because they do not break at all. So if you do hit them, you're probably going to spin out or something like that. But basically, continue onto the road here toward the Arena Workshop. Now, I personally wouldn't actually follow the waypoint in this area. I actually recommend going around the highway over here. It's also a lot easier to dodge the vehicles because we all know the pedestrians in this game do not pay attention whatsoever. So continue down this road here like you normally would back into the other side of the city and basically go all the way down the waypoint like you normally would here. Now, if you guys wanted to, you could take a left by the police station in this area, but I found it a little bit easier to go straight. But after that, you guys would then want to take a left on the second road over here because it will basically give you a straight shot into the checkpoint by the pier. I personally found this to be the easiest way. Now, if you guys were to take a left by the police station, you will still probably complete this in time because I did beat this with about 10 seconds to spare going the second road over there. So I would say either way will probably get you there on time. Now, when it comes to the vehicles, any of the supercars could probably beat this. And then I would also recommend using like the Hakucho drag bike or even the reverse, something like that could probably do this. But luckily, even a sports car could still complete this with a lot of time left on the clock. I would say basically any of the vehicles are going to be a good option on this one. But if you guys have any questions at all, let me know in the comments below. Here's the time trial. And then for the RC Bandito time trial this week, we have the Construction Site 2. 